San Jose State, the scene of a hate crime tonight. Swastikas and hateful language were found in two dorms. KPIX 5's Betty Yu is on campus tonight, and Betty, classes just got started. That's right. School has only been in session for about a month, and at least one swastika found on a door in a public area inside Washburn Hall behind me. A school official says that it was made out of name tag stickers and accompanied by hateful messages. Tonight, the school held a forum for students who live in the two residential halls where swastikas were found. It was closed to the media, but the goal was to create a space where students can come together with staff and openly talk about race issues. The second swastika appeared in Campus Village, also with hate messages next to it, on a dry race board in a common area shared by seven people. The school's first chief diversity officer was brought on this year to tackle cases like this and to ensure a safe Safe, welcoming environment for students. Today, she met with campus staff, including RAs. Tried to coach them about how they can talk to students. They weren't given a script, but to really focus on, um, you know, being able to facilitate and listen well to students, as well as to reflect back their perspective, so that students can feel validated. Very sad seeing that. Just the fact that I came just for the diversity and seeing other people being so hateful to. Different races like that. I, I'm not a big fan of that. Obviously, so I don't, don't think, think anyone is. Such now this case is now being investigated by campus police. It comes less than three years after three San Jose State students were convicted of misdemeanor battery against their African American freshman sweetmate. Live in San Jose, Betty Yu, KPIX Five.